Hi everyone, how are you today? Welcome to Big Sky Beauty. I'm Julie and I am going to announce the winner. Um, one week ago today I held a, I made a video that said what is your elf pro favorite elf project or what is your favorite elf product and I got a whole lot of responses on that video more than many of my other videos you know so but the name that we pulled out is not this is a random generator and I don't really know this name I am glad that they're subscribed to me and I'm going to give them 24 hours to contact me now of me and I'm not gonna contact you it is up to you to have watched you know one or two of my videos or at least watch that one to get a hold of me and let me know that you want to claim your prize and that person is number 779 Aubrey Walters okay you can't see that the friggin sun shining and I'm stuck inside <laughs> it's not your guys's fault trust me it ain't this um, yep number in my pool of 107 or 1017 people it was number 779 Aubrey Walters that um, won my first giveaway apart from my monthly one so and you guys know the monthly one is who shares me and gets my name out there the most you know how it is I I'm it's getting redundant saying it so I'm not gonna say it no more but that is who the winner of the elf giveaway is and Aubrey Walters I need you to comment on on said video that I announced the giveaway so that I can um, you know email you because Google Mail doesn't always work and so I need you to comment on that video and then attempt to send me an email and we'll attempt to get a hold of each other you know via that way but absolutely you need to comment on the video though so that I can know that you're trying to get a hold of me to claim your prize because I have sent um, messages that never reach their subjects and I have had people say they sent me emails through YouTube that never reached me so yeah I need you to say I'm here and I want my prize on the elf video that announced this giveaway and it doesn't really say it on the title so yeah <laughs> okay you are gonna be seeing uh, you guys are gonna be seeing a bunch of videos this week where I don't know, I'll probably change my shirt, but I'll be in the same makeup for sure. Um, this, Oh, by the way, this makeup is a video also going to be going up. Um, it's my very first Get Ready With Me. I know I've done a few tutorials, and basically, isn't that really what a Get Ready With Me is? It's just a tutorial with me, so it's a Get Royal, Get Ready With Me tutorial, or whatever. But yeah, it's the same kind of video. I know a lot of you have asked if I would do one in real time. I am just unable to do that, okay? I really am. I just, I cannot do it fast enough. When I'm working on somebody else, my hands seem to work fine. But I think it's because of the angle that I have to twist my hands. I don't know, but when I'm putting my own makeup on, it can literally stretch up to an hour and a half, two hours. <laughs> of course, that's, you know, I mean, getting up, dinking around and all that kind of stuff, but... Um, you know, I could probably do just the face or just one eye or something like that, but I could not go beginning to end without, you know, like what I'm going to do with the video that I did today to do this look. Um, I'm going to fast forward through the actual application and then I will pause or then I'll have it on normal speed for when I'm explaining what I'm doing. So that's going to take me about a month to edit. <laughs> It's going to take me a while to edit, so it'll be a few days before that's up, but I've been getting a lot of comments of people requesting me to vlog. So if you guys would like that, please comment down below. I actually have had my mom and dad used to always comment on that. My kids used to always comment, you know, you should vlog, you should vlog. And I just never had. I was going to wait until my page was up. I had a lot of you asking me um, if I know how to make a vitamin C serum. And I do. I do do that. Um, I do do that. I do that. And I learned from Crazy Miss Tammy over at Uppies Beats 59. Uh, my mom always made her own vitamin C serums, but I never paid attention to that. You know, I didn't have bad... I mean, not, I wasn't old. I didn't need it, right? Well, so I never paid attention. When I first started watching Tammy, which was, I don't know, in the middle or the beginning or the middle of last year... 
one of the second or third videos I ever watched of hers was the vitamin C serum and it had, you know, everything you need to know. I will go ahead and make a brief one for you guys, but just know that everything that I know about making vitamin C serums, beyond what I've researched since then, which are how to put it into facial scrubs so that when you're scrubbing your face, you're getting the benefits because vitamin C absorbed into your skin almost like immediately. It starts absorbing the minute you put it on. Uh, you know, you forgot, you've absorbed everything you're going to absorb within like an hour of, of applying it. So um, I will make that brief video and I will also link Tammy's video below that video so that you guys will know you know, plus I want to give her credit where credit's due. The measurements and stuff that I used came directly from her, so I'm not going to skeeve that from her. So I will link all that down below when I put that video up, which will be probably shortly after this one. Um, also, I've got a homemade mouthwash that all you guys know I have lupus. I get a thrush type thing in my mouth often. It's not like thrush that babies get, like the white patches or nothing. You wouldn't know that I even had it, but my mouth is super, super sensitive. Like, just cold water burns. I mean, it's just ridiculous. And and it really sucks because I love hot food. And when my mouth is like that, I can't even I can't even eat like tomatoes, you know. It just burns so bad. I have tried everything. The doctors put me on the Diflucan and the, you know, told me to eat yogurt, which I hate yogurt. Ah. You know, told me to do everything that you would do for a yeast infection because that's basically what thrush is is it's a candida overgrowth in your mouth um, but I have tried everything that you can imagine the doctors have prescribed everything and they have gotten to the point where like Julie we don't know what else to do we don't have anything else we can do for you and so I started oil pulling and it it worked and it's the only thing that has ever helped for me so I'm going to do a quick video on that because if it can help one other person that has this problem that I have in my dang mouth then I'm it will be all worth it I don't even care I made my teeth a little bit wider and it's you know it's it's really good really really good I cannot say enough good things about oil pulling and I do it with coconut oil uh, yeah so, you're going to be seeing me having pearly whites here pretty soon. I go in today, as a matter of fact, as soon as I'm done filming this video, I go in to get um, molded for my porcelain caps. I'm sure you guys have noticed I don't have the best teeth. Actually, they're, they're nice. I, got, I have good teeth. They're just, the lupus is making them turn gray. It's discoloring them. Um, I am fortunate in that my disease does not... Um, it hasn't affected my skin like it does most people. Most people, or a lot of people rather, with lupus have lesions really bad and rash, the butterfly rash. And and I do get the malar, but I firmly believe that through meditation and my essential oils, I beat that thing back more often than not. I really do, because I know people that, you know, take that heavy steroid cream that I take sometimes when it starts to flare up and break and actually break the skin. But... You know, I'll put some of my essential oil mixes on it as soon as I first start feeling it come out, and it'll sink back down, and I don't hear from it for months. So I'm pretty sure that I got the scoop on that. But nobody out there that has lupus, ask me what that is, because I would hate to give you something that would hurt you. The whole liability thing, people are so happy, and I ain't got nothing. I got nothing. I got what's in this room and a good heart. That's all I got. <laughs> And a bunch of giveaway stuff. Okay, so, um, Aubrey Walters, you need to get a hold of me in the next 24 hours to claim your prize. If you don't, I will pull another hat, I will pull another name out of the generator, and, and that's who it'll go to. So, you guys let me know if you want me to vlog, then I will do that. Um, and watch for a couple videos coming up on some... I think really interesting things so I'm also gonna start doing more um, like dramatic looks you know I can't make my skin look as as smooth and flawless as it would look on you know a 20 year old doing the kind of looks that I can do but you know you see on Instagram Vegas Nay and um, makeup by is it makeup by Hrush or whatever name is and you see him doing these beautiful eyes and and I could do all that I just when I do it on my eye it's like you know this beautiful design on an old eye <laughs> so I'm gonna start doing it anyway because that's really why I'm here I'm a makeup artist I, I mean I, I 
you know, I was going to do my DIY stuff to for filler videos, but in the end, I'm a makeup artist, and that's what kind of videos that I would prefer to do. I just noticed when I play, when I download and play them back, I just noticed how old I look. <laughs> oh, man. Anyways, what I was saying about my skin, my teeth, because I got way off track there, and I know that. Um, I am going in and getting fitted for porcelain cats because the lupus has made my teeth discolored. But I am very fortunate in that it has not broke me out in lesions. Um, I've got the muscle aches and joints and pain and all that kind of stuff that I'm sure I know a few of my subscribers are my loopy sisters, so you know what I'm talking about. But I feel very, very fortunate that these are all things that I can deal with without it stealing my self-esteem. And I've got, uh, there's a support group here in town, and there are a couple people in it that I just feel terrible for because they are very, very, you know, they're, they don't have so much joint and bone pain but their skin is just wrecked and I think for being almost 50 years old and having lupus for 16 years I think I look okay so yeah I'm gonna start doing tutorials and stuff like that on you know looks that I've done over the years and um, hopefully pretty soon I'll have a new set of teeth I hope all of you that are watching me had fun at IMATS I hate you all <laughs> I'm just kidding. I would have loved to go to IMATS, but you know, the truth of the matter is, I've talked to a couple people that went, and it was such a push and shove rush of, of people that I don't know if I can handle that. You know, there's a reason why I live in Montana. <laughs> I just, I don't do well with huge crowds. I get, I get anxious. The noise starts to really get, get to me really bad, and I don't, I really don't think I can handle that, so I don't know. You know, I don't know about... I guess I won't feel jealous about not making it to IMATS any, IMATS anymore because I don't think that I could mentally or physically handle it. Uh, just walking around would kill me. But, I gotta say, I would go through it all if I got to go to, like, per se, Nix's or anybody else's after party and get the haul swag that freaking Samantha Riley got. Oh, insanity jealous going on here. When I see that, I'm like, oh, oh, no. And then at the same time, I'm like, right on, Tim. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know if I'd ever be able to do that. You know, that's a whole lot of people. And, man, I'd be punching people in the throat. And <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'd be poking people and stabbing them. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I might. I don't know. I don't do crowds very well at all. So, yeah, I don't know. On this video, I discovered the entire butt end of it is just gone. It wasn't very much. It was only like maybe a minute, minute and a half. And I don't know what the heck happened to it. I must have. I'm not really sure. But <laughs> that's why I'm gone. And all of a sudden, I come back and my hair is different. And I'm picking te food on my teeth. We're eating dinner. And yeah, so sorry about that, but I love you all so much. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe already. Um, remember, uh, Aubrey Walters, be sure and get a hold of me. You have until approximately 6 o'clock tomorrow. No, by the time this video goes up, probably about 9 o'clock tomorrow night to get a hold of me. Otherwise, the gift or the giveaway goes to somebody else. Okay, I love you all. Bye-bye.